In order to find a solution, we need to look at both sides, and sometimes we need to try to implement parts of both sides. The right tends to want to make things easier for the majority of people, with the theory that it will trickle down to the minority of people. The left tends to want to make things easier for the minority of people, with the theory that it will trickle up to the majority of people. The reality is we need to do both, even though making things easier for the majority of people is the status quo. But I don't really see any other way of doing it than, you know, to try to implement both sides, not without it eventually turning into people trying to degrade the majority, which we've already been seeing. We need to be clear that there needs to be a balance. None of that's going on. Nobody seems to be calling for a balance. But then again, people don't seem to be aware of what their positions actually are. Especially, I'm sorry, the right. The left doesn't seem to be aware of their actions. But the right doesn't seem to be aware of their positions. Anyway, we need to be clear that you can't demonize the majority for simply being the majority. But we also need to look at why the left is doing what they're doing. As I said, to continue the status quo is to continue this system that we have that pretty much focuses on the majority. And it essentially upholds a classist kind of system. Now one could say that it's a system of white supremacy, but most people end up interpreting that phrase in the worst way possible. You know, as if people are saying, oh, you're all just a bunch of white supremacists. And it's just, no, that's not what people are saying. But just, just avoid that wording entirely because it's completely misinterpreted. And then, of course, the more that people try to explain oh, what it really means, the more that people say, oh, well, you're just a, a Marxist, SJW, cuck, uh, whatever, right? And they just, they just won't listen. So just, just like, don't say that phrase. Don't say it's a system of white supremacy because it's always misinterpreted. Always. You know, the biggest problem with trying to discuss any of this stuff is when the left tries to talk about, you know, propping up minorities, they're called, you know, authoritative SJW cucks with all this stuff. And then when the right essentially, through what they support, uh, want to make things you know, easier for the majority, they get called racist, sexist, and sometimes even fascist. So, yeah, how is anything going to get discussed when that's going on? Again, though, I, I think one of the biggest problems is that the right wing doesn't seem to be willing to look at what their, what their model perpetuates. You know, what does it perpetuate? If, if you just don't care about any of that, oh, well, the, the market will settle everything. Yeah, that's bullshit. It's bullshit. No, the market isn't just going to settle everything. It's, it's not going to work that way. You know, just like pr saying prayers doesn't help a problem. Telling teenagers not to have sex doesn't, doesn't bring down unwanted pregnancies. You know, um, sometimes you actually have to do something about a problem. Anyway, 